See some juve, man. There we go. Well, it was amazing. It was. It feels great, you know. Second win, second race in LMPC class with ALMS with Core. It was amazing. Like you know, coming here with the tips, Ryan, coming to a track where I not even did one lap in dry, uh, just three laps under like a river of water flowing on the track. So it was amazing, you know, going out today, starting on pole and trying to keep the car in front. And I did it. I made it. You know, I was. It was a challenge for me, and and uh, thinking that it was going to be hard, you know, trying to get to to speed in the race for the first time here and uh, it was it was good you know it feels great winning the race winning a uh, second race out of two and uh, extending the points leadership and well it, it's it's going to be a long year but i think we can fight to win it i want to thank ryan for all the hard work and for all the tips that he gave me before the race and it was good and he did an amazing job so let's see what he have to say to to finish this i've done pretty much everything else here. I've uh, driven champ car and open wheel stuff and uh, Daytona prototypes and GT2. So uh, when Alex and I were, were talking uh, a month or so ago, um, I offered my services to, to try and get him up to speed. It's, a, it's an extremely difficult uh, street course, it's very short. Um, and you know, we just want to see him do well. I want to see him win this championship. And I'm good friends with the guys at CORE from my relationship last year. And I mean, the job that this guy did after doing absolutely no dry running, three laps in the wet, um, and at a street course is extremely difficult and was extremely difficult conditions in the wet, the three laps that we did. Um, but to be able to, you know, start on the pole and, and pull away and, and fight with guys that have been here multiple times uh, at one of the most difficult venues. So um, give me the car at the front and uh, we had a good balance in the car and we just, we put our head down and we tried to extend a lead and then save some fuel and then I got the green light at the end to kind of put some laps down so I had a lot of fun it's uh, such an amazing event and uh, really happy to, to Alex for extending his lead and uh, happy they invited me back and you know congratulations to the guy at Core Autosport. It's a little bit more special for me uh, 10 years uh, to this weekend that I made my debut in North America racing Atlantics back in 2002 so um, I ended up on my head at the first corner of that venue but I came on to uh, have really strong results after that. I won here in 2004 and um, had some good runs uh, in everything I've run here. It's, it's just a little bit special and again it's just I'm, I'm honored to be part of this group and, and to help Alex uh, extend his lead. Yeah we're going we're going to Laguna at least that's a good track for me it's a track that I've already drove last year with the DP and uh, I'm glad to go there. Uh, right now we're trying to figure out who's the driver that's gonna try to do the rest of the season with me it will be. I will be glad if Ryan was able to do it, but he has lots of conflicts with the, with the WEC and some DP races. So we're working out to see what the races that he can do and try and figure out what's the driver that's going to be with me for the rest of the season. But uh, we're going back to uh, Long Beach, to um, Laguna to try to win our third race in the row. And I think if we won Sebring and we won here, I think we can do it there also because it's going to be the first track uh, with the LMPC car that I've already drove. So. It's going to be a good uh it's going to be a good racer. I think we can win it and we're going for it.